Alright, so here they go. Uh, game one on Dreamland. Uh, this stage pick usually seems very dependent on the players. Uh, if a Sheik's going to camp, or if a Sheik really feels like they can handle the space without getting camped by Fox, then they're going to want Dreamland. However, there are some Sheiks that just prefer Yoshi's, so... I guess we'll just have to see how this game goes. Uh, so far, it looks like it's in Zibby's favor. Uh, CC. Simple. Ah. Ooh, that was really nice. It's probably just a read, but... Oh man, yeah, I do not think this is good. Oh, I spoke too soon. Caught him sleeping. You can't just assume the Sheik player is always going to go straight to their up B. That's pretty guaranteed. See, now Zivi's getting like really up into his space, not really letting him zone. Uh, missed the auto cancel. Need a big fat grab. And. He's gonna get that back throw. Ah, he rolled away. See, but something I'm starting to respect from all these players coming out of town is that they're really good at picking back up on a punish if they drop it. Yeah, that first 40% is so hard to deal with a fox, and if you can't get that on him quick, that would be through a really smart grab, smart use of needles, and really well-spaced aerials, really safe. And you're probably going to get screwed. Ah! Oh. What just happened? I'm See, I've been, I've been doing that for like months. What? And, okay, so like... Fox tries to go in towards the stage with the Firefox, and you stage back in the pair. Yeah. Love doing that. Alright, so Sofa is playing Sheik, right? Yeah, yes. Alright, so we have two Indianapolis players here facing off in Terra Hope. See, like I was just saying, I really only ever knew these guys as Smash 4 players. Yeah. Um, and I know they both played Melee, and they've been around for a really long time. Yeah. But I, I just didn't know if they were still. They were still at it, but Sofa King was really strong against PhD. Yeah, Sofa. Sofa's just now getting back into melee. I think this is his first tournament uh, since he's decided to start playing it again. Uh, I remember him and Sovereign both said that. Um, I, I too will will rejoin the melee effort because my main reason for for stopping playing melee was the fact that no one around me would want to play melee, but. Yeah. Since Sofa lives like a mile away from me, <laughs> <laughs> he just decided to re start playing it again. I guess that means we're going to be on a grind. <laughs> Sheik's aerials are always so strong. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Before 40 per or after 40%, yeah. yeah. When I first picked up Sheik, I would just scream at myself from getting CC'd before 40%. CC. Yeah, just Crouch like canceled, sorry. All, all the foxes okay. here just CC shine everything I did, and I'd have to either finally learn a, a really good neutral and get good grabs, or see, I've just started playing mobas, and you said CC, and I'm like crowd control. And huh. I was like, how does that? I mean, I guess it is crowd control. I guess. <laughs> yeah, two OP. Please nerf. Up till why? <laughs> I'm up smash happy. I would have gone for like two like up smashes there. I mean, hell, like the only KOs I got in the crew battle were up smashes. <laughs> it's really funny. Uh, you notice it more in Sofa than you do uh, ZB, but when they're fighting in the neutral, once Sofa wins, he can't. It. I mean, like his conversions into like a punish don't really go that far. He seems to be playing very read-based, so yeah. it's either going to work or it's not, and so far it's not. Um, I mean, I kind of go the same way. Uh, it's like a work in progress, but until then... Ground Smash works in this game? <laughs> yeah. 
Like I know, like you know, I I almost feel like a super grimy chic player, because like I would go into friendlies with people like, who were like in my pool, and then I would get their tech. I would like play kind of differently, yeah. and then I would just get their tech pattern. Oh. Because <laughs> I'm really bad at the reaction. Yeah, I started doing what Mango does, and I literally just roll my control yeah. stick. Yep. Roll your stick. Yeah. Uh, I like I'm trying to think. Do, how often does that get you tech in place? Or do, does it start to skew towards tech away? Um, I don't... I haven't noticed it. And, like, uh, it, it was really funny. I don't remember who I was playing, but they, they were like, what what way do you, do, do you... Are you even DIing right now? I'm like, I don't know. I'm just doing the we'll other thing. <laughs> you just go random directions. Cause like, and make sure not to roll the same way each time, because I think if you do roll, roll forward... You're kind of going to do it at the same speed? Yeah. Oh. oh. Bad mistake. Oh. He's been going up for the up air too early each time. Yeah, see, like, that's another thing. Uh, there are the people who are able to react to that up throw, and yeah. then there are people who have to be prepared for the up throw. And Self King definitely seems like someone who has to be prepared for it, because he's missed the DI a lot. Oh. Oh. That might be it. Oh, nice on the tail. Oh, kind of reaching. I'm so proud of at Melee's camera. <laughs> no, because like that's like Smash Force camera is really stupid. It zooms up all on you, and it's like you can straight up spike someone onto the stage, and like you won't even see them hit the stage because of the camera being so zoomed in on you. Oh yeah. And I'm like, get out. <laughs> or offstage fights are hilarious because you two never know if you're gonna, gonna make it back to the stage because you don't know where you're at. <laughs> yeah. Sofa, looking Shona's, like the 4 Glory player with all those yeah. rolls. Shown a Smash 4 prowess. <laughs> uh, you know, that was smart because, like, he obviously recognized that the aerials were high on shield, but yeah. he crossed it up. Um, and he paid for it. Fox Hop Air. It's those situations where you just have to be really consistent with your mirrors out of shield. Yep, you see him DI in place. Uh, yeah, it's to the point where, like, I miss the buffer turnaround a lot, so I usually go for up smash and twice. Oh, thanks for correcting my name, by the way. Shout out to you, Shakara. <laughs> no, I really am trapped. <laughs> Me and the crew battle was... Like, I was supposed to be the Marth, like, kind of. Yeah? Because my record against Marth and Bracken is pretty good. You should play my Marth and Bracken. I would like to. I actually play Link. <laughs> oh, okay. But, no. Uh, now that I know you're <laughs> Um. No, I'm all, I'm all right in the melee. I'll start playing it again, and then you'll regret. All right. Oof. I wish PM was still alive, so I could play Zelda in oh, a yeah. game where she's not awful. That's all I want. <laughs> Zelda triggers me in PM. <laughs> I play Snake in PM. Oh my gosh, you're still, I mean... Yeah, I know, I can't complain, right? <laughs> but, except I can complain about Zelda. Because Zelda is like the one character where none of Snake's stuff works. <laughs> like... She can freaking transform into Sheik and get rid of the C4. Like, none of the combos work, and she can hit you out whenever you try and, like, follow up. Like, Base may has... love actually having invincibility on startup instead of just in the middle. Yeah. That's, like, the, the weirdest thing about it in every other Smash game. It's like, you're invincible just in the middle, like, a little bit before the attack comes up. A lot of players have been doing this today. DI forward, tech behind. Yeah. They always oh. follow them as, the, as they go forward, but they need to be... And I'm guilty of this too. Uh, you need to walk forward where they're where they're drifting. Yeah. And only start running uh, when they tank or when they don't tank. Yeah. There it is. So. Uh, is that three out? No. Yes. Yeah, so that's two one. two one for Zivi. And it's best of three. Uh, I think it's best of five. Yeah, because last. Well, last yeah, game. that's what I meant. Sorry. Yeah. First of threes. Yeah. 
as some call them. Uh, somebody doesn't have Congo Jungle unlocked. Wow. I don't know, I remember trying really hard to get it, and I was just like, forget it, I don't even care that much. 15 minute melee is not worth it. <laughs> <laughs> That was uh, me highlighting uh, Shakarath's recent comment. Who's Shakarath? I don't know. Uh, I'm sure he knows my tag. <laughs> that's, that's scary. Who Probably are you? Probably some alternate name. Like, I know a uh, banana sack from Purdue came in here as uh, Jason Zimmerman's left nipple. So, <laughs> gotta watch out for those stream monsters. Why does everyone go for the left nipple, though? That's a real question. I don't know. You should attack that. You should have. Z needs some Smash 4 at Fox showing. See, in those situations, you gotta be ready for them to grab the ledge. Yeah. And you gotta, like, pull away before you do your food. It's the only way. Could you do me a favor and, like, move the mouse off the screen so it's not triggering me? Thank yeah, you. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I hate this mouse. It's, like... Super sensitive? It's so unsensitive. Oh. Like, uh... I play, like, Osu, which is, like, a... Yeah, I know what, I know what it is. Yeah, so I'm, like, used to super high sensitivity. Like... No, I'm kidding. No, it's turning me into a weave and I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking binge watched JoJo's Bizarre Adventure over here. Oh my gosh. O so did one of my break. friends. He like, I watched five episodes with him and I was like, well that was good enough for me. Because they started First that new line and I was like, whatever. Yeah, like, if you can make it to, to like, season three, then it's great. Or part three, I guess it's technically yeah. season two. But, but, yeah, it's bad. I'm like... The highlight of my week is a new JoJo's episode on Fridays. I'm just like, I didn't want to be this. It's <laughs> the one thing that wasn't supposed to happen. Oh, it's Captain Jackson. Uh, Jackson is Terra Haute's resident uh, Falcon player. Who, I guess, left. Honestly, at this point, he probably would have done better in the crew battles than me. Jackson? Yeah. Well, he's he's been playing a lot of Falcon Falco recently. Yeah. Uh, because Falco uh, was like the easiest top character to play. Yeah. The easiest character to learn at a, at a decent level. There you go. Yeah. They, it has the best balance of like how much you're allowed to mess up in a combo versus how easy the character is. Yeah. Because like Fox is like you you're really given a lot of leeway, but you have to nail it. Yeah, you have to be on if you are not. Yeah, Sheik is like physically easy to play, but you can't drop a punch. Yeah. Like you're just not allowed to. Like it this would have been not close if if Sofa had the textures, but you don't and you're at an extreme disadvantage. Yeah. Cause like you'll see it, like he'll win the neutral and it's just where do you yeah. go from here? <laughs> I mean, cause all Fox has it is doesn't really have to approach if he does want to approach. Oh, he should have gone up. Yeah, he should have. If he does want to approach, he can grossly out disjoint and then just hold down as he jumps and CC whatever you do. Um, it, you have to be very smart. Yeah. Uh, like right there, he should have just crouch canceled down tilt. Like, I'll be the first to say, Chico Jenkins is not smart. Chico. <laughs> but he is. <laughs> but man, is he good with Fox. Yeah. We, we always he joke around. He's super destructive. Oh, yeah. Um, Ooh, that was good. We always joke around about Chico Jenkins' ice climbers because he is good with nothing with ice climbers except getting the wobble to the point where if Nana ever dies, he immediately kills himself. <laughs> and uh, and he can just stick around and down smash all the time. He's bound to get some percent. Yeah, but why do that when he can just wobble, right? Oh, <laughs> how punches. the tables have turned. Oh, man, close game. but And... Uh, Zivi went on Dreamland and Stadium, so uh, Sofa King has has shown that he's the kind of player that wants the small stage. So I think it's either going to be Fountain. No wait, they already played on Fountain. So. Yeah. FD. FD. Yeah. This first thing Fox player is going to do when they go on FD is get those ladies. Uh, you keep doing this, don't you? <laughs> You're like a high school teacher. What is this? I know. I'm really bad Maybe at like. You should look into that. <laughs> I'm a music education major. That makes sense. So, yeah. Look at you. Look at me. Um, yeah. But. 
Oh man, I can't, I can't remember what I was going to say. Oh well. Oh. Yeah, I didn't think you'd go for that. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, it's always so strange. It's always easier to think outside of the moment, like, watching other people play and then and making their decisions for them is a lot easier than just watching yourself, like, playing yeah. the game itself and then if being I, like, why did I do this? If and I could do this while it, playing, jeez. Yeah. I'd be PR. <laughs> <laughs> um. You'd just be like, these are all bad decisions. But you know that's that's what separates the good players apart is they can do that in the heat of the moment. Yeah. Yeah. Every time. Like <laughs> if if you, uh, the options you have to be able to react to that properly are a, like what I said earlier, mm -hmm. um, and that b you can watch their feet or c you can actually watch the camera. Right. And or, the camera is going to shift in the direction. Or d and watch their controller like Armada. And Xbox. Yeah. That's why he stands up. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> yeah, like that was like confirmed. Like he like stands up so that he can see the other player's controller. I mean, I don't think that's a bad thing. I'll just play with my controller in my shirt whenever I play him. <laughs> just be like, this is the reason why I wear oversized clothing. <laughs> yeah. What did you think? <laughs> Me and my friends back from Indianapolis always joke around about like the, the really like, if we had like no shame in mod games we would play in bracket. Mm -hmm. Like, we always talk about like, hey, what if we just like repeatedly sat up and stood down during the entire set? Just like repeatedly, just like. <laughs> no, I don't feel it. <laughs> you have to have no shame. Man, this is hard because I like both Zevi and Sofa. Or just like the moment the match gets high stress. Oh dang it! Have like one very well timed like fart. Oh my gosh, no. <laughs> Once again, we're talking about no shame here. Yes, and if you did, the other person would start <laughs> laughing and they'd lose. <laughs> yeah. It's all about the no, W, right? Okay, yes. Just just go out, have yourself some chili, eat some Mexican, and then do your tournament. That's why we have the Taco <laughs> Casino, like right right like 100 feet away. It's all planned. Body oh, that was good. <laughs> okay, so, yeah, this is, this is really close. Yes, it is. It's super oh scary. Oh, my God. I don't want Sofa to lose, but at the same time, I also want to go home. I'm tired. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> he's, oh, he's still in Smash 4 anyway. Yeah, that Dang time, it. That time uh, Sofa King waited for it, <laughs> but he was just... Dang it! And, ah, there it is. <laughs> I cursed him for no reason. <laughs> yeah. Alright, and... Uh, uh, and Zivi takes it. Zivi. Zivi. Everyone always slaughters his 